Hi, I'm Elena Scott, and this is Tire Business News Minute, the industry's video news show. It was a busy week in Las Vegas as travelers from around the world came to see the Apex and SEMA shows. During the Global Tire Expo at the SEMA show, the Tire Retread and Repair Information Bureau named its new managing director to replace Harvey Brodsky, who was let go after serving in the post for 37 years. After a careful deliberation, the board had unanimously, unanimously agreed to take Trip, Trip, who is the voice of retreading, into the future with uh, David Stevens. There are many good reasons why we were in total agreement to select David, such as his leadership skills, his media planning, trade show management experience, online marketing experience, partnership development, website management, and a very good understanding of new technology. Uh, first of all, let me say how excited I am for this opportunity. Um, you know, it, it, uh, being unknown to the industry, uh, I would love to just talk a little bit about how I think my background and skills ultimately recommended me for this position. Um, I have about almost 20 years of multi-industry experience in managing PR, marketing, uh, sales and customer service. Uh, I've worked in the telecommunications industry, uh, the internet services industry, uh, credit cards, and financial services. Meanwhile, the Tire Industry Association unveiled a health insurance plan for its members as well as workers' compensation, garage liability, and product liability insurance for retreaders. So this is really the first time since the early 80s that we have a comprehensive program for every aspect of our members' insurance needs. I'm really excited about this. When we went through all the reform and insurance and everything, it was hard to keep association national health care plans, and we're really excited about this. Finally, during the SEMA show, Tire Business awarded its annual Tire Dealer Humanitarian Award to Jerry Rosenthal, president of Tire Hut, a single location retail dealership in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. The award recognizes outstanding charitable activities and public service work by an independent tire dealer or retreader. That's it for today's News Minute. Be sure to read our November 8th edition for more on these and other stories. I'm Elena Scott reporting from Las Vegas, and we'll see you back here November 15th.